Okay, what are we doing? Whoa! Okay, so that's what we're doing. Glad I didn't get hit from that. That would have been unfortunate. Yeah. Whoa, what? Stuck. Stunk. Come on. Are you for real? Seriously? It was like two shots and it was over. That was sad. Well, then again, I didn't have a whole head of health, but... Okay, three. Fifty damage right off the bat. That's sad. Too bad I can't see what a person's watching. One versus two. I should have been able to kill that guy right there. And I fucked up badly. This guy survives, I will be surprised. Never mind. Spoke too soon. Uh, well, the name fits it Overkill. Yeah, they, they made this way too hard. Way, way too hard. Wow, I got more renown playing multiplayer than just co-op. That's sad. I think I've seen all there is to see of this game. I think I'm done. I just... I don't know. I don't know, this doesn't interest me as it did before. There could be more than, you know, one, you know, type of gameplay for terrorist mode, but... Really? Like, they made it that much harder? That's ridiculous. I remember playing on hard mode and I would have my fair share of wins and losses. I'm on normal. I can't. I only won one. Of course, it wasn't on stream because this was last night. But. They made it too hard. They made normal mode too freaking challenging. Yeah, yeah, get good. That's not the point. The point is, is they just. Holy frig. And then they storm you like crazy in normal mode. It's probably only going to get even more crazier on hard difficulty or even realistic. <sighs> this game is definitely not worth $7.99. Or, seven, sorry, $79.99. This game is not even worth $60. This game is worth $30 at best. Because it's online only. 
I hope this doesn't go the way of Evolve and they shoot themselves in the foot and it's over. Because really, apparently Evolve is dying out. I don't know, maybe Black Friday sales, you know, brought it back, maybe. Considering you could buy it for like 10 or $20 for like the cheapest prices, depending on where... I don't know. I know it was ten dollars up here in one place in Canada. I think the minimum price was twenty dollars down the states. Actually, no. There was a place that charged ten dollars for it for Evolve, and that was down in Best Buy in the states. Either way, in the end, the point being is is that if people weren't interested in it for for thirty dollars maybe people bought it for ten to help like resurrect it but if not a lot of people bought it because there was a lot of good deals especially down in the states a lot better deals this series you know evolves never gonna get picked back up it's probably gonna be a dying breed it's it's just gonna you know whatever and when people say multiplayer needs to be in video games, no, no, it does not have to be in video games. Like, this isn't tacked on multiplayer by any means, but you need single player. You need single player stories in your game. Because this only works for so long. Sure, the hardcore addicts may sit there and play it day in and day out. But when the casual gamers, yeah, well, people may say, yeah, well, casual gamers, of course they're not going to play it along. Because they're casual gamers. They play other stuff. Well, no. I mean casual players as in, like, people who don't sit there and play the game constantly in that aspect. But, I mean, if I bought this, I would only play it every now and then, but... I don't know. They just they just change too much. I just can't do this. Well, this has been Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege open beta. They ramped the shit out of the fucking difficulty for this game. Especially for normal mode. I, like, I don't know. I don't think it was called for. Like, yeah, sure, you need a challenge, but... I mean, they should have made normal mode a little bit easier, and then, if anything, what I've been, what I was playing, that should have been hard mode. Anyway, that's it for this. Let's try.